What are ways to find and identify and really shape that audience out? Is there any, are there any platforms, sites, tools people can use? Is there a methodology or framework? Yeah, I, I, I've been using Spark Toro a ton since that came out to do this. So, you know, you can, you can just basically what you need to do, work out your, who, who your customer base are and then find examples of, of like prototypical customers and start to work out well, what else is going on in their lives, what else do they care about, what else are they doing. And that's going to give you a lens into discovering and exploring different topics and different kind of communities. Spark Toro is great for that because you can just put in like an interest group. So say, say I discovered who that I was making something for like a load of builders. And I discovered quite rationally that something that a lot of builders are interested in is like trucks because they're carrying stuff around, like they, they care about that. Okay, well, let's find out on the internet, like who are the most influential people in, for trucks. And then I can find this community, okay, who follows the most influential people? And you can start to build up this kind of, this actual database of potential target audience. And then you can break them down, look at what they really care about, look at what they're doing already on social media, meet some of them, ask them. And, and you know, that is how you essentially build up this picture and this narrative of who you're going after. Um, the other thing you can do is just like use Reddit. So sub, like, if there's a subculture, there's a subreddit and there's always a community on there talking about stuff. And if you can find active subreddits and see that they're slightly underserved in terms of media, then that's when you know you can come in and do something interesting. Um, mm. So it's about thinking kind of orthogonally about who your customer base is because your customer base is not like usually we as businesses we start to talk about customer bases if they're like a homogenous group that talk to each other now it's very rarely the case they normally you know subsets of different communities and groups that often don't interact so you need to identify okay well what are those communities within our customer base and you know pick one basically and it's usually for a, for most companies it's going to be narrower than your wider customer base that, that doesn't mean but there are instances where if you have a very very niche product that only appeal to a few people. You need to think slightly broader and slightly you know, more about that community. But the, the key thing is discovering like wh who is already talking to each other about a thing and let's make stuff for them.